oxides of nitrogen. They are the binary compound of oxygen and nitrogen or such. Some important terms. Denitrification is the breakdown of nitrates to nitrogen gas. Nitrification is the oxidation of ammonia with oxygen into nitrites, then into nitrates. So where do these oxides come from? They can be found naturally and artificially. Here are some examples of oxides that can be found naturally. First, in soil and water. It is true bacteria break down in oxygen depleted water bodies. Second, in lightning and air. Lightning is formed with nitrogen and oxygen reaction at high temperatures of around 30,000 degrees Celsius. Third, in forest fires and bush fires. Next, let's look at the oxides of nitrogen via man-made means. First, emission of exhaust fumes from vehicles. Burning fuel in engine produces combustion temperature enough to oxi oxidize nitrogen. This nitrogen is emitted as exhaust fumes. Agricultural soil management. They are produced naturally in soil through microbial processes. Emissions of nitrous oxide can be increased by adding additional nitrogen to soil. Animal manure management. Nitrous oxide is produced from organic nitrogen in livestock solid waste. Sewage treatment. Nitrous oxide is generated from the nitrogen present in urea, ammonia, and proteins. Nitrification is aerobic, denitrification is anaerobic. Combustion of fossil fuel. Nitrogen and oxygen produces nitrous oxide during combustion. Adipic acid production. Nitrous oxide is also a byproduct. Nitric acid production. Most of them are manufactured by oxidation of ammonia, and nitrous oxide is a byproduct. Effects Forms acid rain Sulfuric and nitric acid from nitrogen oxide forms acid in the rain Global warming Oxidation of nitric oxide forms of nitrogen oxide Splitting of nitrogen dioxide to nitric oxide and back forms ozone smog Hamper plant growth. Damaged roots, leaves, lakes, and coastal regions may kill plants and cause living problems. Health problems. Oxides of nitrogen can form other toxic materials like ammonia, causing health problems. What can we do to minimize harmful effects? Thank you.